So here's the uh, Whirlpool Kenmore in my friend's house that's in the garage. I brought this over just for the heck of it because I had fan motor issues and he knows how to work on motors and crap. So we got it running and it seems to be running fine. We've not really done anything to fan motor at all, but. No, uh, once I get my zoom spot in though, I will yeah, go we'll have for a rebuild. Work this. I did, I did try to do, um, I tried to hit I it up. I can also with, straighten yeah. the fins on that yeah. too. I might do that myself actually one of these days while we're over here. I have, but, the, watch, I have the watch screwdrivers, they're, they're a perfect <laughs> diameter. Oh yeah, here. they will. We got the uh, nice condensate puddle going over here, I mean poodle. Got a bit of condensate back there. here. Earlier we were having... Oh, that's nice and cold. <laughs> it's nice, it's actually the coldest condensate I felt in a while. Earlier it's coming out this hole and when it's going it's just dripping down the mortar. And just like, yeah. So now it's coming out there. I guess it, I guess it was, had to do with high fan. Actually, I might try to see what it does on high fan. And it doesn't look too bad here. I absolutely love how it looks. So. <laughs> I could have just paused the camera, but it didn't. It's seen it looks amazing in here, too, with the wood grain. Even though this garage is, like, extremely modern. Feels good in here. It's the best room of the house, probably, besides the basement in terms of temperature. And I lost the uh, I lost the fan control knob for some reason, which is sad. Yeah, the house was built in '53. Uh, it seems some up, uh, updates, some very questionable. <laughs> the outlets around here are really nice. Hell, there's just the outlets in the garage. I wish mine had yeah, that. Apparently, the people that used to live here, this was their uh, pottery work area. So. Yeah. It makes sense all the way out. Oh, there's like condensate and stuff all across the top of here. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's nice. You can turn your flash on the video. I sure can. Samsung, man. man. <laughs> gotta love, yeah, gotta love Samsung. Apple Dad is on the other side, I think. Yeah. You can see all the condensate running off of it. But I am curious if I do switch it to high speed fan. If it does, if the condensate will start dripping out in the other hole. That's something else. <laughs> I'm like... Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's see. Because I think, I think it'll be the, the slinger wheel that's flinging it over to the other hole. Yeah, because now, yeah, now it's not dripping out of that one. So it's going to start building up and then dripping out of that one then. Yeah. So um, yeah, it's the slinger ring. Oh, why did I turn the flash off? It's running really good. I had the coil on this thing cleaned out too. I got this one, worked on this one earlier this season. I might try, this might actually, I wanna, the next thing I wanna test is the fan motor. Is the fan motor on it still locked up, like how it was before. Okay. Where it was doing the thing where it just didn't wanna start up again on low speed, so. I don't hear any bad scratching noises, yeah. so. I think it's just the bearings are dirty. Too worried. Yeah, too worried. Slow down for a little bit. No, it's not starting up on low. Medium. There it goes. Yeah, it's still kind of stiff, so I'll definitely very go stiff. That. Drop it back down to low speed now. Here's saying we can brush shutter now. Oh yeah, actually I'll probably just turn it off now. Okay. And get the refrigerant sound because people like that. Refrigerant back. It's probably going to start pulling out like a street. It's going to pull out like a street stream of condensate, probably. Because oh, yeah. now it's now that it's shut off. Yeah. There it goes. Yeah, there's yeah. the condensate. Still hear that refrigerant flow. Matt's a sheet of rotary. Suction line's all sweaty, too. Great unit. Yeah, that's a pretty decent performer. Uh, I've actually never had any experience with a window unit, so... You'll definitely... Like, Just I might... be besides that uh, 80s or 90s um, yeah, whirlpool, whirlpool casement, whirlpool. which that was a, was a school property. Yeah, some point in time, like I might mess around with some more. Like, um, I have the the little hot point carry cool units. I have I have two of those. One of them's at my friend's house. The other one's over at my mom's. I'll bring it over because I can't install units over there. You can see that one. 